That light is probably wrong, but hi everybody, this is Fox Nomad. And today I wanna to help you travel smarter by taking you to the Market Hall 9, which is a street food fair that happens every Thursday night between about 6 p.m. and 10 p.m. every Thursday night, and that's right down there. So I wanna go there with you and show you some of the street food. It's not very well known, so the street food festival, even for locals, even for people who live around the neighborhood, this is in Kreuzberg, a lot of people here, maybe in the immediate vicinity, might know about it, but visitors certainly don't really have a good idea of it, and even a lot of locals have never been here. So I'm really excited to show you all the kinds of food that you can find inside. Let's go. So right now it's very, very crowded, but here's a pro tip. You come here around 12 o'clock on the day on Thursday, or on most weekdays, you'll find a couple of the most popular vendors are here. You can get food without all the crowds, but right now it's about 8 o'clock at night and the festival is full, full of people. Alright, so I was looking for kind of a quiet corner to film and there's really not one and I'm not really hungry because if you saw my video before I was eating all day so I decided to get this uh, adult beverage hopefully not too adult so I don't get demonetized but I wanted to talk about some of the things that I shot uh, first of all I ran into Momo Man which is where I first ran into Momo Man which is here selling Nepalese momos, which is great. We're gonna be seeing him tomorrow for a special video. That's gonna be the next one after this, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss that. Otherwise, it's really grown since the last time I was here, which was about two years ago. There's a lot more variety than there was before. It's about as crowded, maybe just a little bit less crowded than it was before. Um, there's takoyaki, the takoyaki guy is still here from Japan. There's a new Manta place, so there's a little bit of Turkish competition here so there's the traditional sort of Turkish cooking which is the beans and chickpeas and olives and that shop is always open but the Manta place which is kind of like a Turkish ravioli which has either spinach and cheese or in this case ground beef sort of cooked in a tomato sauce with a little bit of garlic yogurt on top and some oil and some parsley and that is also being sold here now as well. And I'm right now at the Berlin Balls. Sell these Berlin meatballs here, which is very good. Um, they've also got drinks. There's a beer counter as well. That's just a little bit down here. And the entire size of the market hall, so this used to be a market, not surprisingly. So the entire size of this is, well, I'm not quite sure, but it's pretty large. Everybody gets a small stall. It has different days. So on Saturdays, there's like a breakfast this kind of festival. Sure. Sundays it's a rotating festival of different types of themes. There's a meat and dairy market here on several days where you can buy groceries, fresh produce. There's also an Aldi in here, so it's a small grocery store which has nothing to do with anything. It's sort of the most random thing here. But Thursday night is sort of the big night where everybody shows up and a, a lot of the vendors have said that they've done really not a good job of sort of promoting the Market Hall. So the Market Hall 9, they've not really promoted it so well because they've noticed that the crowds have sort of slowed down and dropped and it's mostly locals, people who live just right sort of in this neighborhood but not a lot of foreigners or outsiders coming here. So if I can recommend to you, so if I can recommend to you anything to do if you are in Berlin, it's definitely worth coming here on a Thursday night. There's a lot of food, there's a lot of drinks, good wine, Spanish food, there's Syrian food, wine from everywhere, obviously a lot of good beer. It's not very expensive. You're gonna have to just walk around a little bit to get good seating. So about 9.30, 9.45, it dies down very quickly because Germany efficiency, they close right at 10. So if you can get here a little bit earlier, closer to 5, 5.30, that way you can grab a seat and make sure you have a seat. Otherwise, you're gonna have to walk around and sort of catch a place, but it's as crowded as it can be right now. It's right in the middle of the rush. And I found a place right here, standing right next to the Berlin Balls, having a beer. And uh, it's not so incredibly difficult. So uh, I think this entire video is gonna be food porn with a lot of different montages of food because I don't, it's, it's hard to stop and talk, sort of describe everything that's going on. And anyway, it's better on video, I can just show you. So here's one of those montages. Here you go.
So I've eaten at all those places. The tofu place is great. The cannoli place is great. Tiramisu place is great. The antipasta place is great. Where else? All the beer is good. Um, anyway, whatever else I'm showing you right now, it's also good. I've probably had it before. Enjoy. place where he's getting beer is full. Seems like the crowd seems to shift from alcohol to food, back to alcohol, back to food. I could see living here. It seems it's one of those places again. So I don't know. There's just there's something about maybe it's all this international food. Everybody seems very happy here at the moment and just kind of wish ah like the whole world could be like this or something. You know it's not but you kind of wish right? You can dream. I'll leave the address and the directions here in the description below and while you're down there hit the like and subscribe buttons I hope you found this video useful it's been very difficult to shoot because it's just sort of me right now and it's a lot more crowded than I was expecting got here a little bit later than I was expecting but hopefully you've enjoyed this video it's useful and you visit Market Hall 9 the next time you're in Berlin Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. And while you're down there, hit the like and subscribe. subscribe.